Mighty News, the summer update has dropped, featuring cosmetic crates and unusual effect, both fix that only lasted about 7 hours, localization files, and this. I'm not a guy who makes reaction videos, but I decided to make this cause no one is talking about this. In sum, by far the most idiotic approach to the MVM toxicity issue. So, what actually changed? Before the update, you could examine your teammates' loadout and upgrade by pressing inspect bind while looking at them. Now, you can't do that unless they are your friend or party member. Mm -hmm. We can assume that their purpose was discouraging toxic behaviors in MBM. One of the most common reasons why people kick newbies in MBM is haven't upgraded properly, so. But that it means that their reasoning was like this. Hmm, if I get rid of teammate inspecting mechanic, people won't kick newbies for upgrading not properly. How naive are they? What kind of reasoning is that? If you are an experienced MBM player, you can instantly see that this doesn't seem right. But what I've seen were a lot of people celebrating this? It's a short-sighted, idiotic approach. You all need to see this correctly. Let's assume that there's a spectrum that represents MBM player's toxicity. On one end, there's a player who kicks people for not upgrading flawlessly to the meta without letting them know. On the other end, there's a player who always advises newbies what to upgrade and explains why. But most people, including me, belongs in the middle ground. For example, who doesn't care about newbies at all, willing to give them advice but only if they know the basics, which is me, kicks newbies but only if their upgrades are far beyond inefficient, and many others. And then, teammate inspecting is now disabled. What will happen? This. Let me explain why. First, skilled players can tell if their teammates are doing good or not with ease, without even seeing their upgrades. Because of that, this won't discourage toxic players from kicking newbies for underperforming at all. Not only that, they can easily change strategies like this, from demanding to upgrade correctly, to forcing to tell what upgrade they selected. So, what this change actually does about the MVM toxicity problem is, adding one more reason they kick newbies for, not telling their upgrades. But, oh boy, worst thing happens on the other side players who are willing to help new players. Now to give them advice correctly, they need to have a chat with them every single time, and have to recreate their upgrades only based on their chat. You can argue that this won't take that long, but adding an annoyance in the process is more than enough to discourage high tours from giving the device. I want to die. Many people on the bright side will move to the Grey Legion because they don't want to risk getting annoyed by the chat. It sounds like the solution for the toxicity issue, but what it actually does is promoting toxicity. Now you can see why I said this was a short-sighted, idiotic approach, because it is! Adding an annoyance and exchanging info only causes lesser constructive conversation. Belb needs to understand this. In conclusion, disabling teammate inspecting was totally unnecessary and should get reverted ASAP. End of the story. Then, you might ask like this. What can Belb do to fight toxicity then? To be honest, not that much. I think it's up to us. New players need to understand that knowing the basics is essential, and high tours should become open-minded towards new players. It's not a problem that'll be solved if we point and villainize someone or something. It'll only be solved if we all agree to have a constructive conversation rather than KILL YOURSELF NEWBIES AND BURN THOSE TOXIC HIGH TOURS ALIVE! Anyway, that's the end of the video today. Let me know what you guys think about this, there might be a point I was missing, so... I hope they rethink about this as fast as possible. Anyway, hope you guys have a nice day, and see you soon again.